Gender and Sexuality Finney's work is considered both erotic and sometimes frightening. She often explored the power dynamics between men and women and consistently challenged surrealist patriarchal traditions. As a way to revert gender roles imposed by the surrealist movement, she portrayed men as muses in her paintings, as submissive and even androgynous. She objectified the male form as a way to give any female viewer the opportunity to take the dominant role. Leonore Finney was definitely ahead of her time in regards to gender and sexuality. She had romantic relationships with men and women and was consistently surrounded with past and present lovers. Surprisingly, this always worked well for her, with little to no animosity between them. Finney herself had a unique idea of how relationships should work, seeing how in her later years she kept two to three men with her in her living quarters. This situation was ideal for her, who believed that one should have two companions, one more a lover and one more a friend. <laughs>